There's a big solar eclipse happening on April 8, 2024. Imagine standing under a darkened sky in broad daylight, witnessing the sun disappear, replaced by a glowing ring. This is the magic of a total solar eclipse. A solar eclipse, a celestial ballet of alignment, occurs when the moon, on its orbit around Earth, precisely blocks our view of the sun. It's a spectacle that relies on the perfect alignment of the sun, moon, and Earth. While solar eclipses are relatively common, it's the total solar eclipses that truly leave us in awe. On April 8, 2024, another such cosmic spectacle is set to occur, with a path of totality spanning 115 miles, casting its shadow over major cities like Austin, Dallas, and Cleveland. For those within this narrow path, the grandeur of a total solar eclipse will be an experience like no other. The splendor of a total solar eclipse, a cosmic spectacle, is a sight to behold. The path of totality, a narrow strip where the sun is completely obscured, is where the real magic happens. It's a celestial dance, choreographed by the laws of physics that unfolds in a path roughly 115 miles wide. This is no ordinary shadow, my friends, it's the umbra the very darkest part of the moon's shadow where sunlight is completely blocked out. The path of totality is the golden ticket for any eclipse chaser. It offers an experience that's out of this world, literally. Within this path, the alignment of the sun, moon, and earth is just perfect. And the moon cloaks the sun in an otherworldly twilight. The stars come out in the middle of the day, and the temperature drops. It's like standing on a different planet if only for a few minutes. Major cities such as Austin, Dallas and Cleveland are among those lucky enough to lie in the trajectory of this path for the upcoming solar eclipse of April 8, 2024. Imagine standing in the heart of these bustling cities, and then, as if someone flips a switch, day turns into night. It's an eerie yet beautiful spectacle, something that you can't quite put into words. But the path of totality is not just about the darkness, it's also about what comes after. At the end of totality, as the moon starts to move away, the sun peeks out in a dazzling display known as the diamond ring effect. It's a sight that leaves even the most seasoned eclipse chasers breathless. Yet, despite all the spectacle, the path of totality is fleeting. It races across the earth at over a thousand miles per hour. It's a blink and you miss it kind of event. But for those lucky enough to be standing in the right place at the right time, it's an experience that lives on long after the light returns. Being within the path of totality is a unique experience, a celestial lottery win. It's a moment of connection not just with the cosmos, but with our own sense of wonder and our place in the universe. During a total solar eclipse the sun's mystical solar corona comes into view. Imagine the sun our very own fiery star momentarily shrouded in darkness revealing a radiant halo of light and energy. This, dear listeners, is the solar corona. A breathtaking spectacle. A crown of plasma that's usually hidden by the sun's overwhelming brightness. The corona is not alone in this celestial show. Keep your eyes peeled for the prominences, they're remarkable too. These are large, bright features extending outward from the sun's surface, often in the shape of a loop. They're actually huge clouds of glowing gas, tethered by the sun's magnetic field, dancing against the backdrop of the cosmos. While they're present all the time, it's only during a total solar eclipse that we get to see these fiery loops in all their glory. And then there are the Bailey's beads. But these are not ordinary beads, named after the British astronomer Francis Bailey, these beads are the last specks of sunlight shining through the rugged lunar landscape right before and just after totality. They create a fleeting, bead-like pattern of light around the moon's silhouette, adding a touch of magic to an already awe-inspiring event. The solar corona, the prominences, the Bailey's beads, each a marvel in its own right, together they present a rare and beautiful sight that's nothing short of astronomical poetry. They remind us of the grandeur of our universe, of the cosmic dance that's been going on for billions of years, and of our small yet significant part in it. These phenomena transform the sky into an astronomical theater. A theater where the sun, moon, and earth perform a cosmic ballet, creating a spectacle that leaves spectators spellbound. So, mark your calendars, prepare your telescopes, and get ready to witness the grandest show in the universe. As awe-inspiring as a solar eclipse is, it's crucial to remember that safety comes first. Now let's talk about how to safely observe this celestial spectacle. The danger lies in the fact that looking directly at the sun, even when it's mostly obscured by the moon, can cause serious eye damage. This is because the sun's intense light can burn the retina, the area at the back of your eye that contains light-sensitive cells. One common misconception is that it's safe to view the solar corona with an unfiltered telescope. This is not true. The solar corona, while less bright than the sun's surface, still emits harmful ultraviolet and infrared radiation. Using an unfiltered telescope or binoculars to view the corona can concentrate these harmful rays and cause even more damage to your eyes. So how can you safely watch a solar eclipse? There are a few options. 
The safest method is to use special purpose solar filters, also known as eclipse glasses. These glasses are designed to protect your eyes from harmful solar radiation. They filter out all of the harmful ultraviolet and infrared light, and nearly all of the intense visible light from the sun. Another safe method is to use a pinhole projector. This simple device allows you to view a projected image of the eclipse, preventing any direct viewing of the sun. You can easily make one at home with just two pieces of card or paper. For those who want to take a closer look, you can use a telescope or binoculars, but only when equipped with a certified solar filter. These filters attach to the front of the telescope or binoculars, blocking harmful radiation before it enters the device. Remember, regular sunglasses, smoked glass, or homemade filters are not safe for viewing a solar eclipse. They don't offer enough protection against the sun's harmful rays. Last but not least, if you're lucky enough to be in the path of totality, you can safely look at the sun without any protection during the brief period of totality, when the moon completely covers the sun. But as soon as the sun starts to reappear, it's time to use your protective gear again. With the right precautions, everyone can safely enjoy this astronomical spectacle. A solar eclipse is not just an astronomical event, it's an experience. This sentiment echoes in the hearts of all who have ever stood beneath the moon's shadow, marveling at the grandeur of the universe's celestial ballet. We've journeyed through the fascinating details of solar eclipses, understanding their occurrence, the path of totality, the glorious solar corona, and the importance of safety measures. Let's recap briefly. An eclipse occurs when the Sun, Moon, and Earth align precisely, a cosmic arrangement that is relatively common, yet awe-inspiring. The path of totality for the upcoming event spans 115 miles, crossing major cities like Austin, Dallas, and Cleveland. While many will witness the eclipse, only those in the narrow umbra shadow will experience totality, the moment when day turns into night, and the solar corona gleams in the sky. The solar corona, that ethereal glowing halo, is a sight to behold. During totality, it reveals itself, along with other phenomena like prominences and Bailey's beads. But remember, safety is paramount. Never view the solar corona with an unfiltered telescope. Protect your eyes and enjoy the spectacle responsibly. The anticipation builds as we inch closer to the date. April 8th, 2024. A day that will etch itself into the memories of those fortunate enough to be in the path of totality. An opportunity to connect with the cosmos to feel a part of something larger than ourselves. If you have the chance, don't let it pass. As we wrap up, remember that a solar eclipse is more than just a spectacle. It's a dance of celestial bodies, a reminder of our place in the cosmos, a shared experience that transcends borders and unites us in wonder. On April 8, 2024, don't just observe an eclipse, experience the universe dancing right before your eyes.